Hi, and welcome to Blue Tangerine Solutions Tutorials. In this tutorial, we will be using the Easy Remote Admin of your Blue Tangerine Solutions website to upload a PDF file and then create a link directly to that file. First, you will need to define where you want to place the link on your site. For this tutorial, we're going to place a link that links directly to a PDF file containing a list of features for this specific model home. Next, you will need to log in to your Easy Remote Admin. Once logged into the admin, you will need to locate the page that contains the information you wish to edit. In this example, the description for the model is entered in through what we call the WYSIWYG Editor a tool allowing you to format text and images within that area of the page. Next you will need to add the text that you want to link the PDF to. In this example we're going to add a line below the last paragraph in the description. Next highlight the text you wish to create a link from. Click the insert edit link button within the tools of the WYSIWYG editor. Within the link pop-up, click the Upload tab. Now click Browse. Choose the PDF file you wish to upload. Click Open. Now click the button Send it to the server. A pop-up box will appear, letting you know that your file has been successfully uploaded. Click OK. You will now see that the URL field has been automatically populated with the link to your PDF. Next, click the Target tab at the top of the link pop-up. Within the Target tab, choose the Target drop-down and select New Window. This will allow the PDF file to open within a separate browser, not taking the user away from your website. Click OK. You will now see that your text has become an active link. It is important to remember that you will not be able to test the link within the WYSIWYG editor. First, you will need to scroll to the bottom of the page and click the Submit button. Once the submit is complete, we can now go back to the site and review our changes. Once back on the site, click the Refresh button. You will now notice that below the description of the model, we have a link for a full list of features. Test the link by clicking on it. As expected, the test PDF file that we uploaded opens within its own tab. One important note to remember. If you choose to have a second link to the same PDF you just uploaded, but from a different page, there will be no need to upload the PDF a second time. Simply enter the text you want to link the PDF to, highlight the text, click the Insert Link button. From the Link pop-up window, instead of clicking the Upload tab, click the Browse Server button. From here you will see a list of all files that have been uploaded to the server. In this case the test PDF file that we uploaded in the previous tutorial. Click the link to the test PDF file. The URL is automatically populated with the link to the PDF. Click OK. That concludes this tutorial on how to upload and link to a PDF on your website. 